America's opioid epidemic appears to be getting worse. A new government study shows the rate of drug overdose deaths was two and a half times higher in 2015 than in 1999, so in 16 years. Researchers at this Centers for Disease Control and Prevention said one in four drug overdoses as 2015 was linked to heroin. Emergency crews say the difference between life and death in opioid overdose cases is a drug called Narcan. Well, right now, Kansas lawmakers are trying to make Narcan available for the people who need it. It was used more than 200 times last year in Johnson County to save lives. 41 Action News reporter Ali Hoxie takes a look at new legislation to make the life-saving drug more accessible. When a person overdoses, they can go into cardiac arrest and stop breathing. Using Narcan can help them start breathing again that can directly attach to an IV setup. Paramedics not only use Narcan for people addicted to drugs, but also those who might accidentally take too much of their medication. That scenario happened just this morning in Johnson County. Elderly gentleman who he's prescribed morphine and took too much of it this morning and caused him to have a a sinkable ep episode or pass out. On Thursday, the Kansas House unanimously passed a bill to make Narcan more accessible. Right now, EMS can use Narcan. However, if passed, the bill would allow police, pharmacists, and even bystanders to administer the drug. We have really no framework or way to train, educate, and inform uh, family members, bystanders, the lay public, law enforcement on the administration of naloxone. So if this passes, it sets up a framework so they could administer this potentially life-saving drug. If Narcan is accidentally administered, it will have no negative side effects. However, Narcan cannot break anyone's addiction. This is a Band-Aid fix. This does not solve the opioid addiction issue, the opioid epidemic that's going across the entire country. Now it is up to the Kansas Senate to vote on the bill. Reporting in Johnson County, Allie Hoxie, 41 Action News. A similar legislation is already on the books in 47 other states.